Using user data for machine learning, what do AI companies need to be aware of? I think that's a very interesting question because there are gray areas as we speak about what user data can be forwarded to third-party services and what user data cannot be. And I think the guidelines and legal instructions are not very clear on this matter. As a rule for most companies, you should not be conveying the customer data to third-party application unless it's written in your terms of services. And also even that, when you plan to do that, you should obfuscate the personal information of customers from the data. That means removing the columns in databases for the names and addresses and other personally identifiable information and use the data only for research and development purposes. And once you do that, you have to make sure that there is no way that you know, these customers can be identified from the information that you have released to these companies. Big companies have always cross promoted their data and you know, cross access their data like Facebook Pixel a tool and a script that can be embedded in a website uh, to get the information from the users that are visiting the website and their operating systems on mobile phones and their browsers and other small information that helps them improve their products. And that information can be used to provide better service as well. But when it comes to other information like payment information and race and gender identifiable information, that can become a legal issue. So before you actually cross share your data, Make sure that you are legally entitled to do that and there are no concerns of privacy and safety. So the data that you train your models on must be authorized data that you have the right to use that data. And that can only happen if that is in the jurisdiction that you're operating in. So for the U.S. companies, they can only train on the data within the U.S. or the data that is in the public domain. And that can be from anywhere but you cannot use the data from other countries or let's say other organizations that they have not explicitly allowed you to use. And this is why and there is a lot of gray area when it comes to the legality of these models because it infringes upon the rights of a lot of people. And as of now, there is no clear guideline on how to regulate these technologies. How to train AI models while protecting user privacy? I think it's a very good question because one way that you can train these models is by a technology called federated learning. So federated learning can happen on the consumer devices, whatever devices they're using to use the service, for example, mobile phones, iPads, or desktops. The data is processed and trained right on the mobile devices using the processing power of the devices that the customers are using and the service on. And then that train model, their weights and biases is then transferred to the central database, but not the user data itself. And that can be one way to ensure the rights of consumers and to ensure the safety of their data. One more thing and that can happen is that data should not be transferred across the seas in multinational corporations to ensure to that you know you could complying by the local laws and regulations. For example, recently we have seen in US, there was a huge issue uh, with TikTok where they had to bring in the CEO of TikTok and ask him questions about the safety and privacy of the data. Uh, US regulators um, have been cracking down on Chinese companies and organizations with a lot of um, allegations. And you know that has to do with the safety and privacy of data, even though TikTok has assured that all the U.S. data is on the U.S. soil and has never been transferred to China.